Alright guys, today we're going to talk about template files. Now, the difference between an Adobe Illustrator file and an Adobe Illustrator template file is the extension. A template file is .AIT. An Adobe Illustrator file is .AI. Now, the reason that this is an advantage for you is that whenever you save a template file, you don't have the option to save it as .AIT. It'll automatically save it as a .ai unless you go to file save as template which is you'll notice there's no keyboard shortcut so it's a little bit hard to get to and that makes it good because you will not overwrite your template files without doing a little bit of work and we don't want to do that we want to keep our template files so where does Adobe keep our template files um, if we hit new from template or hit new and then there's the templates down here but we'll just hit new from templates um, it'll get to the same place It'll open up this folder called templates. Now, I don't remember creating this folder. I don't know anything about this folder. Where is this folder? In fact, it is hidden. And it is hidden over here <clears throat> under Adobe Illustrator, cool extras in US and templates. So once we have one of our fun little templates open, this is keep calm I made with the Babis font. Let's say I change something, Bevis, kind of silly, um, and I want to save it. Or I'm just going to hit Command S because this is how most of us overwrite things by accident. Uh, you'll see you get a save as instead of it just saving. And that is good because, woo, .ai, you won't overwrite your file unless you do it on purpose by hitting File, Save as Template. And then you'll notice it still says the untitled. So if you want to overwrite one of these, just click the name and it'll come back. All right, that's about all you really need to know. Um, in summary, template files are good if you don't want to overwrite what you've done. And Adobe Illustrator is pretty annoying at how it manage them, manages them. But you can keep them in any other folder and just open them up by double clicking the normal way. Thanks. Have a good day.